Okay, let's have a look at sand. This is a fairly recent one, I think. Uh, we'll pull our MP5 off again. 12 of those, yep. Okay, I think this is a fairly a fairly compact sh short sightline map as well. Uh, it's also fairly flat. I think it's a little bit of uh, two-story stuff, but not much. And these textures remind me a lot of original Counter-Strike. Oh, and look, some double doors. How classic. Oh, more double doors. More double doors. Okay, this map might have a fetish. Oh my god, it's all double doors. There's so many double doors. What's going on? Oh, it's crazy. They took like one aspect of uh just leave those guys alone for now they took one thing from dust and we're like yes Ooh, they can walk up there? Damn, I did not know about that other entrance. Oh yeah, this is pretty cool. Oh, I got a way in from the roof. Damn, we can get up there. Oh yeah, well, this opens up a little bit, I guess. Still wouldn't be sniping on it, but yeah. You can walk around on your clear roof. That's pretty cool. Oof, man, he saw me from behind himself. One left. Okay, and you can walk off of some of these spots as well. And hop down these boxes. Mm. can sort of see through the level a little bit here. Yeah, it's okay. This looks like it would be like the place to be in this map. Oof, watch out for those ramps. All right. Now I've got to find the last guy again. Bloody hell. Hello. I'll lift it back here. Wow. We need to kill on that one, huh? Yeah, this level's alright. That one's okay. Too many double doors though. You're gonna need to mix up your design a little bit. Um, I like the house in the middle. The, that, that sort of little building complex there with the, uh, the big house that you get on the roof of with the boxes inside and the one across from it. That's good. The whole central part is good, but this sort of circuit around the outside with a thousand double doors, not so hot. Um, another new one I saw was Stacked, which I believe is like a remake of a, I don't know if it's a remake of the um, Call of Duty map or not. All right. I'll take the MP5 again. It's pretty, it's fast and light. It'll work. Okay, let's have a look at Stacked. Mm. Okay. Yes. Yeah, colors are a bit washed out. I don't know. Strange. That's a mahogany chest. That's a bit of a weird color choice. And that one is way too bright. 
It's like beech wood or something. I don't know what they're going for. Crates aren't made out of these kinds of timbers, guys. Can I fit through here? Well, I got loud very early. Floating ammo boxes. A bit weird. I'm just going to keep moving. I want to get up onto the second level. Oh yeah. So we've got some verticality at least. I think that's the one thing I'm missing from Arctic is some verticality. It's a, it's a dead flat map, that one. Alright. Can you drop out of here without getting hurt? Yes you can. That's alright. And we go up here. Oh yeah. Breaks up the sight line through here. There's a couple of pallets. I mean it's very simple. There's only like three different objects in this entire map. Jump is. I swore he was right here. There we go. That's yeah, so stacked is okay. Very simple map, but yeah, it's alright. Got a little bit of verticality. Could be a bit of fun. That's a pretty casual, fun little map. Not quite as good as um, Arctic. Old Town. Night version. Alright, let's see what we got. I think this is one of the older maps in the workshop. We will pull a M16 up. We'll just set it up to 12 so we can run around a little bit. Um, yeah, I can't really tell much from that map apart from the fact that there's too many cars that have left their lights on. If the owner of a uh, Blue Mondeo Let's night vision it up. Oh, let's just un-night vision and just have a look at the colours that we've got. The thing with most night maps is you can make them in fantastic colours and barely anyone will notice because um, they'll just be in green mode the whole time as soon as they see a night map. Um, but we will go to green mode. <laughs> let's go have a look at this map. I have no idea where I am and what I'm doing. Alright, what have we got? We've got guys in here, yep. This map does load them. Um, these planters remind me of Hanoi in um, Black Ops. Black Ops 1 had a map called Hanoi. Had an area that's had a bunch of planters in it. It was very open. Quite strange. And they've seen me. against the building so I'll be coming over here now. Alright, so now we can come in on the back of them a little bit. Um, this is that central hub I guess. We'll just have a look at this without the night vision. Oh yeah, it's kind of red. It's kind of nicely lit. We've got the main street over there so we'll come up the back of the main street I think. We'll just look out the corner of this map. Okay, so I built a big timber wall to stop the cars from getting out. That makes sense, sure. They could have done like an Italian city gate and it would have looked not moronic, but it's a massive timber wall. Um, if you look at a lot of old like Italian towns because they were built as forts when before the nation became a nation Everyone had their own fortifications and the towns were built inside the walls and they had these big ass arches that you could put doors on. So it's not impossible to lock a town in without being so cheap about it. So that looks ridiculous. Apart from that, this does look a lot like an Italian town. So I think that's what they were going for. So we'll just go down here. Can 
Can we go in any of these buildings? I don't think these buildings have any interiors. A lot of buses. They're all buses. Of course. Just parked jauntily down the street. Buses for everyone. And we've got a bigger fruit market here. Oh, fish. This is where we keep the fish. At night. We just keep the fish out here. Ooh, another big timber wall down this end. God. <laughs> oh, this makes no sense. This looks really stupid. Okay. I don't mind the low poly buses. You can do what you want with those. Oh, I can't find anyone now. I've sort of forgotten where I was. Oof. Jesus, it is dark down there. Lol. There we go. Um, that's... Old Town. Eh, Old Town ain't great. Um, right, Old Town Night. Alright, let's try something else. Let's go to Sea Storm. I like this one. Um, bit, 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 rifle man, yep. Uh, we'll turn it up to like 12 maybe. Just like going rookie. Just so we can have a bit of a walk around. It's a quite a large la um, map, this one. It's a big oil platform with a lot of different layers. Okay, and it is a daytime map, not a nighttime map. Even though it's quite dark, but that affects the AI. So of course they can now see for miles and miles. And there's a couple of open areas where they will see you, even if you can't see them. All right, but it looks, it's pretty impressive. It's got nice baked lights. The light levels are quite good. Ooh, that's dark. There's usually a couple of chumps up around here. So now the other ones will be coming, which means we have to leave. There's some odd things, like this texture is, is quite low. That, that's quite a uh, low quality texture. I'd like if there were hand railings on these maps. Gonna keep escaping. Hopefully, they get shot in the back. Um, we'll have a little bit of a look around. This uh, the textures are a bit, yeah, they're okay. Need some little caps on it or something to break it up. But this has a working elevator. Not sure how to make it. There we go. It's going. So this is pretty cool. We've got a level with a working elevator. Not sure how, oh yeah, yeah. so it's the index finger that makes it go. I don't know if you can pick a floor, but there is only two floors. Need some elevator music though, which wouldn't be difficult to add. But that's, it's pretty cool there's a working elevator on this map. There's a bunch of guys way over here. down those stairs. They got really good vision. Just had to check. Okay, a couple of the barrels are a little bit bright for in here.
But yeah, there's a ton of variety, a lot of area, and so much verticality. Probably need like a little bit of cleaning up, like in terms of stream, streamlining the, the play. But I guess you can put guys wherever you want. So many different rooms and places you can go. There we go. Got them all. Not too bad. They can really sneak up on you. you can see, there's a lot going on. Yeah. So that is a sea storm. Sea storm, the oil rig. And yeah, it's um. Just bring that a little bit closer to me. Pretty good map, that one.